Hi guys, welcome to the short video about the safety of small key lock boxes. Here I have a really nice one. It's called Y Mooch or so. It's working really good. It's solid. It's good. It comes with the app and everything has been working really good. But I've been wondering if it would be possible for some other person to download the same app and then try to connect and get an emergency key or something like that. The reason why I'm actually not 100% sure about safety of this device are actually two things. When I set it up, I mean set up the connection or connected the app with this device, there was nothing to press. No button, no reset button, no connection button, absolutely nothing. I just added the batteries and I opened the app and I was connecting and I didn't even have to pair. Usually you have to pair two Bluetooth devices here. Absolutely no pairing uh, was needed. So when you are pairing a device, then usually nobody else can pair to such a device. But when it's not paired, then it's open for everybody. So let's check and see. So here we have it, you can see it's open, we can close it, let's assume we have it here on a door handle and we just close it and nobody actually can access it uh, unless you have this app, it's connected, you can see I can click, this is the app which I've been using before and you can tap and hold and it will open, you can see, so it opens nicely, absolutely no problem, we can close it again. So let's assume we are far away and somebody would try to steal the key. So let's go to the Bluetooth, disable that. So I'm disabling Bluetooth even here. So like we would not be in the area and now somebody comes here and downloads the app. I mean, everybody can download this app and then set up an account. There's no proof, no nothing. You just need an email. You can take any email and you get confirmation then and then you are in the app and the question is what can you do i mean i'm selecting this lock box here and then it says reset the device please install batteries into the device and make sure the bluetooth has been opened okay enable bluetooth next let's see what happens yeah, we have to give uh, authorization, of course, searching for Bluetooth devices. Let's see if it finds this thing here or if this device says, OK, I have been connected previously to some other device. I won't let any other device connect to this thing here. And it looks like at least it takes some time. I mean, you can see it's definitely powered on. We can even give some emergency power here. So I added it to the USB-C. You can see it had some power, but it's saying no devices found. So it went again into timeout. Definitely no way to connect to this key box here. So it looks like this is definitely safe. On the other hand, uh, I don't know what happens when we delete the app here and we don't have access here anymore. Let's say we lose our phone. We have to set up the app here on another phone and then start from scratch and uh, reconnect. Will it be still synced here with the key box? That's another question here. Maybe I can show you this in a follow-up video if you're interested into that, but at least it looks like it's safe and that's the result of the video. So I hope I've been able to help you a little bit with this video. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. See you next time.